Hey guys, welcome back to part two of the 2015 STI. And well, for this video, we got something a little different. Not much people like it, but right here we got a light bar for the 15, or yeah, 15 WRX STI. Did I say 16 markers? I think I probably said 16, but the light bar is gonna go right down here behind the grill area. So it'll look kind of OEM, you know? So yeah. I hope this looks good. So let's get right on and opening the box and we'll see what we got inside. Okay, so I got everything laid out right here. These are the trim removal tools just so I can get out the little clips that are everywhere. I'll show you them in a minute. Here's the little harness, whatever it's called. And then here is the little bracket so I could, what do you call it? Just mount on there without like drilling or cutting. And then these go on the side of the light bar. And then, well, there's the light bar. I believe it's a 30 inch light bar. So yeah, let's start off by taking off this front bumper. Okay, so opening up the hood, we got one screw there, we got one clip there, one screw, one screw, another screw, and then we got a clip, a screw, a clip, a screw. So I believe that's in total all nine things. And then Mark is gonna start working on that. And then we got another one right here. We got like a little screw where you have to put a, what do you call it, a screwdriver in, you take out the middle, and then you can pry out the rest. We got one of, the, one of these on this side, and then we got another one of the same one on the driver's side as well, right there. Can't see it, where is it? So it's right there, yeah. So we got one of those, and then we got them under the bumper as well. So let me get under there and show you. Okay, so right here now I'm under the bumper, and then there is six. Let me see if I can find them. So there is, two there so it's this one right here and then where's the other one at another one right there and I can I cannot really see this and then there is one right right up here this one right here there's another one right here there is let me scoot over watch out Marcus and then there is the last one is right here with this one and the one right there so let's get all those off and take off this bumper okay so now we got all the clips off the top the bottom and the two on the side so now there should be just a few of those uh i don't know what they're called just like when you pull them out pretty much is when they come out so you just got to give it kind of like a a hard but like lightly tug so you don't break any you know but yeah you got to start off from the side over here and then go to the headlight and then do the same thing on this side and it's preferably better with like two people. So Mark is right here going to help me out. So Mark is going this side. And then you got it Mark, you know how to do it. So just give it a light tug on the edge. You got it a little bit, just from the top. Go down and then come out to the headlight part. You got it? Okay, so just keep it going a little bit. Grab the bottom. And then don't pull away too far. There should be one last one all the way at the bottom of the bumper. Oh, actually, you know what? Hold up. I forgot one clip. Pause the clip. Hey, pause, pause, pause. We'll be right back. Okay, so actually, I was wrong. There's one more clip right, right there, and there should be the same one on the other side. So, yeah. Don't forget about that clip. Okay, so I got those two from the side off. Now let's actually pop this thing off. We got the last little dumb screw off, whatever it's called, clip. Now we're ready. Okay, so just hold it up real quick, Marcus. Because inside here, here, bring the camera over here and show me what we got. We gotta disconnect that one clip right there. You see it? It's this one right here. This one right there. We gotta disconnect that one. And then on the other side, the same one. It's right there. There we go, right there. Okay, so let's disconnect those. Okay, now the bumper is off. So let's hit this in the grass. And well, let's keep it going with putting this thing up here. What the heck is this foam piece? Honestly, don't know what that is, but let's get to putting that, that light bar right here. Okay, so first off, we're gonna get these little L-shaped brackets, and then what we're gonna do is we're gonna get one of these screws, push it through here, and then you see this hole back here? That one, we're gonna push it through, and then on the other end, put 
lock wash, and a nut. That. You see it, Marcus? Mm -hmm. This thing, I just found out this thing is kind of booty cheeks. Anyway, so I gotta run this wire right here. You see it, Marcus? Mm -hmm. For the harness all through the inside. Uh -oh. Right through inside. here. And down. Down here to the light bar, Marcus. You see it? Right here. There you go. Then the rest of this we'll figure it out later. We just gotta finish the light bar first. So now I gotta get these little end pieces and then put them onto here, one each, and crimp them down. There you go. Now those two clips are on. You do a little tug test, make sure they don't come off. I'm gonna hit them one more time with this though. Just make sure they're on for good. But yeah, okay, so those two are on. Pretty much what's gonna connect to that is the end of this harness, which is just this, and then they just connect in like that. Boom, one on each side, red to red, black to black, whatever. And then, following through all this, there's this harness, the rest of this harness, black to black, red to red again. And then, this includes the fuse and relay and all that. That's just, uh, you don't pretty much do anything with that. And then this, I disconnected it off of this little switch because this, I gotta run it under this, right? Under the fender, and then come over here, Marcus. Pretty much, I gotta take this fender off, run it underneath this fender, and through the body, and then inside. Pass me the camera, Marcus. Inside, two, there's a little space. Where's the little space? It's right there. Can't really see this where all the cables are going in, but yeah, let's do that now. Okay, so update. We've been trying to get this wired through this fender well without having to do the whole taking off the fender well and all that. So I've just been putting it through, pulling out a little bit of fender, putting it through, pulling out a little bit of fender, and putting it through all the way into the grommet, which is up, up there. You can see that cable that just ran down right here. And that's this one right here. Boom. So then we just connect this to the end of this, and that goes to this, and then we'll just put that one probably like on the side of the steering wheel, how I had it on the other car. I don't know, we'll see what I like to do. I kind of like it right here though. But, that's the update for now. The light bar is already mounted. It's good to go. It's sturdy. See, that, that ain't going nowhere. So yeah, that's how we have it now. So once I finish wiring that, I'll get back to you, and then we'll put on the bumper, which is pretty much going to be reverse of what we did in the beginning. So just got to do that. Okay, so I have everything buttoned up. The cables are zip tied uh, right up there, right. I don't know if you can see it. Right up there, behind with this bar right there, or with that harness, and then I fire it out through here, and then I'm gonna tape it up like my other one right here. Oh, you can't see right there. Okay, so everything's done. The light bar's put on down there, as you can see. Look, first, let me turn it on so you can see. Right here, here's the button. I need to find better stickiness for it, but there it is. It lit everything up. And if I go from the front, you can see it right there. So yeah, that gives it a meaner look. There you go. Okay, so it's been about a week and well, the windshield's ready. Except for that one big old poo stain, bird poo stain, dumb bird. My new windshield, but anyway, time to take these pieces off. And well, I'll just throw it on there for now. Look at that more poo, bro. And the nasty thing is, like, there's like another big old one right here on my side skirt. And anyway, whatever. Let's get this other side off. Come on, bro. There we go. Look at that. See? Look good. <laughs>